Hi everyone, welcome to Raw Online. So today, like we are going to see a case study pertaining to the rubella infection. So in our last session, like we have learned about the various theoretical aspects of rubella infection. So what kind of virus is that? And we have learned about the genetic material and the genotype. And we have learned about the various clinical future. What are the various symptoms and the signs and how it is going to spread and the pathogenesis. So now, like we will test ourselves how much we know pertaining to this particular topic. So I will show you a particular case and the picture related to the case and I have a set of questions. So let us answer one by one. So let us go into the topic now. So here, like you are going to see a five year old child. So it is going to be a pediatric child and taken to the pediatric outpatient department by the mother with the complaint of rash in the body. So here it is going to be a five years and there is going to be a rash in the body and history of runny nose and fever was present five days back so there's going to be a prodrome stage of uh, fever and runny nose and examination of oral cavity showed the following in the soft palate so what is the diagnosis so whenever like when we are going to handle a case of uh, children who is going to have rash with the fever so so called as exanthematous fever or exanthematous infection that is a fever with the rash so it is very much mandatory to examine the oral cavity so it itself will give one clue of the underlying infection in case if there is something like this kind of rash so here like you are able to see what so here like you are able to see the particular palate so we can divide the palate so you are able to see the palate and here like you are able to see the hard palate and here like you are able to see the soft palate and you are able to see some particular lesion so these red red lesions so these are the lesions so these are nothing but something called as four shimmer spots so which is a pathognomic future of rubella so it's going to be a case of rubella so let us go into the topic now and what is the classical clinical finding so symptom uh, usually the patient is going to have the rash fever and there can be the prodrome of various uh, illness like flu like illness and the clinical signs there is going to be the spotty pink red maclo papular rash and we will be able to see a particular lesion in the soft palate known as four shimmer spot spot 